When you're not feeling well or you feel something is off, sometimes the best medicine is having a doctor and staff who actually listen to you. The next step is finding the right treatment for you. If you suffer from arthritis or an autoimmune disorder, you could be overwhelmed with the different treatment options and where to even start your process. I recently caught up with Dr. Richard Kim with Piedmont Arthritis Clinic and one of his patients on infusion day to see how these treatments work and how they've changed this patient's life. Take a look. Well, Dr. Kim, what should someone with an autoimmune disorder look for in a doctor? Well, I'll tell you, autoimmune disease can present in many different ways. Um, uh, sometimes you, people can have multiple symptoms and signs due to multiple organ involvement. Sometimes it can be very nebulous as well and challenging to diagnose. So uh, in my opinion, I think you'd want someone who is a careful listener and observer. Uh, and someone who is very thorough with their history taking, physical examination, and review of the data. It seems like a hard thing to diagnose and, and pinpoint exactly. So what kind of treatment options do you have for patients? Well, there are many different options because there are many different uh, autoimmune diseases out there. Uh, for instance, we treat a lot of rheumatoid arthritis patients. Um, and there are a variety of traditional disease modifying drugs, including pills, injectables, and infusion therapies. Um, but because everyone is so unique, uh, their therapeutic regimens are individualized. Uh, so it, it's a case-by-case -case situation. When you're looking for, you know, they're looking for the doctors and then you're also looking for a patient, what does it mean to be a good patient? That's a great question. Uh, and as I'm a patient myself <laughs> as well. So um, I think, and it sounds very simplistic, uh, but uh, I think someone who cares about their health, mm -hmm. who tries to make the right decisions, eat the right foods, exercise, uh, and uh, also I think someone who is reliable and trustworthy to follow the recommendations of the, of the physician. So I can't help to ask the question um, also, which follows is what makes a good physician, right? And also what makes a good doctor-patient uh, relationship? And I think those elements apply to the physician as well, right? They need to gain your trust and they need to really care about the patient's health. And so I think this caring and a uh, trustworthy relationship between a doctor and patient uh, provides the best outcomes. And one additional thing that I would be, be remiss not to mention is uh, our wonderful office staff, mm -hmm. okay? Uh, uh, I just can't take all the credit because uh, one thing I've learned after I joined Piedmont Arthritis is the staff is so good at what they do. They're so efficient, they work as a team, and on top of that, they care very much about the patient and what happens. And so. What's better than having a full army of people who are ad your advocates, uh, who care about what happens with the patient, so. Well, yeah. speaking of patients, I saw you interacting with one of your patients who is here now. She comes every six yes. weeks or so, Hayden. So I wanted to kind of go get her perspective and, and, and learn a little bit more about Absolutely. her process. Let's Thank go you. talk to sure. her. Okay. So I am here getting my six week infusion for Crohn's and AS, two hours roughly. Words cannot describe how thankful I am for Dr. Kim and the entire Piedmont arthritis family. Um, I think that a lot of the time, especially when you're young, you feel like you might be a little crazy if something's going wrong, but they have always really addressed my concerns and have always made sure that any questions that I have are answered and make sure that my health is the main priority. My mom um, had experience with this practice. She used to call on them as a drug rep, and so she knew that they were the best. She loved, loved, loved when she worked in rheumatology. And then of course, when she moved on, I was having issues. And so she was like, that's my first call. And so I knew that when I came in for my first appointment, they were the most kind and it felt like a family. And I think that that's really what made the difference and the reason that I want, wanted to be here. I didn't realize the lack of quality of life that I had. Um, and so coming to Dr. Kim and, you know, having everybody kind of gather around and make a plan has made me, you know, a better person because I'm healthier, I'm happier, I can get a lot more done in my personal life, but also I feel really um, helped and listened to and all of that. So it's been really wonderful. It's a great experience. And I would just say to anyone, you know, if you are having any kind of symptom or anything with your health, you know, make it a priority to talk to somebody and just want to, get it all out there so that someone can listen. 
And Peyton said that was her big thing, just having someone that can listen. And so she didn't feel like she was making up these symptoms and she is doing great now. If you would like more information or want to speak to a doctor, you can call Piedmont Arthritis Clinic at 864-235-8396. They are located at 3 St. Francis Drive, Suite 400 in Greenville. You can also find them online at PiedmontArthritis.com.